Hello the people of the universe, this is the Whovian Wizard and welcome back to another video. And today in this video we are once again going to be playing Minecraft Communities. And today we are going to be building something brand new all the way over there. And there you can see the clock tower loading in for some reason. Why is that not loaded in yet? Um, but what I do want to say is I've got some announcements to make. Um, A, so... Not, I think, two days ago now, they added the ability to change your PSN name, and I'm no longer Works War Games, and I'm now the Whovian underscore Wizard underscore. And yeah, I stole the underscore thing from Admiral Avery, which, yeah, fair enough. But still, I like having it, so yeah, this is my new gamer tag, I suppose. And I also, uh, let's just jump off here have to announce I'm adding someone as employee of the month as the, at the um what should I call it cinema what's it called I think it might just be called the movie theater to be honest I don't think it's got a name uh but let's just have a quick stop off here and Pando Mr Pando how are you do you enjoy your new house uh so essentially uh pretty much it's all the same as I did in the last episode Except I've just added a few things up here, uh, just to make it a little bit uh, sort of nicer. Uh, they can see, just see a few drips coming through the ceiling. Uh, yeah, I've essentially just sort of fiddled around with it a little bit, made it look a little bit better. But I'll leave you to your new house, Mr. Pando. Um, and then in here, we have the dogs, as always. So let's go and feed them. Uh, so Gracie, you are fed the cooked pork chop. Lelo, you are fed the cooked chicken. There you go, Lelo. Rosie, you are fed the cooked rabbit. There you go. And Loyalty, you are fed the cooked steak. And I think I'll take... Which dog should I choose to bring with me today? I am going to choose Loyalty. And yeah, so let's come out here. Uh, he'll just teleport behind me. And yeah, so let's go and reveal A, what we're doing today, and B, um, who I'm adding as the employee of the month and the, the second employee at my movie theatre. And there is a sign there. So I don't know whether it has got a name or not. Uh, oh no, I literally just called it cinema. Okay. Um, and where is it? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Employee of the month, and I'm sorry if I mispronounce your name, Audrey Z. E. Audrey Z. Anyway, I don't know. Uh, but on your screen currently, it should be coming up around about now, um, you should be able to see what they did. So I mentioned in one of my old videos, I say one of my old videos, it was probably about a month ago from when you're watching this. Um, actually, they might have been one of my Sims videos, actually. I said, if anyone can draw me as Negan from The Walking Dead, I'll give them a shout out. And Aldrizi did. So I don't know why we're going around this way. Uh, we have to build here today. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to thank them very much for that. And I said, I'll give them a shout out. So there you are, Aldrizi. You are now the employee of the month at the cinema. And what I am going to be doing today is we're going to be building uh, a florist. That's the one. Uh, so we're going to be building a giant plant pot, and I have just realised something. I don't actually have any more terracotta on me to finish doing this. I've got some stuff in that chest there, but it doesn't actually have anything, like, it doesn't have any terracotta on it. I think there won't be any more at my house, because I haven't gotten any recently. So I think we're going to have to go back to uh, all the way over to the old house. Uh, if you remember, like, the one with the walls around it, uh, the big stone walls. Uh, just because I should have some there, because before I lived in the Mesa, I used to take terracotta from there. But however, I do live in there now, so I'd rather not end up destroying part of my mountain. Um, so I think, yeah, I just I just sort of forgot to go and get it uh, before the video started. And there is a pig and a sheep having a staring contest down there. I think they're oh, why are they both stuck? <laughs> um, I'm just going to leave them to it. I don't want to interrupt their staring contest. I'm sure they're having a whale of time down there. 
Uh, so yeah, there you can see just like the sort of mini walls down there. It's sort of like, I don't know why, for a while I just sort of went through a phase of liking to build walls around things. Like you've got these, these big walls over here, you've got the big walls over in the community, that's Laurie's estate, not the community. Yeah, you've just got lots of stuff everywhere. And yeah, it's just sort of good. I don't know, I don't really like it anymore, I don't like building that many walls. Because I just sort of adopted a mountain as my house but hey I used to build walls around everything I have no clue why but I just sort of did just sort of made it a bit more protective uh, so let's walk over here and someone's nicked the redstone from the back of these ender dragon heads why have they done that that's a bit annoying I will admit <laughs> so let's just run over through here uh, out of use, Will was here, crime scene, what's, I should probably get rid of these signs actually, because it's a pretty mellow area right now, there's nothing bad going along here, and yeah, so there should be some stuff over here, and what's this, Johnny, Johnny Gat, why is Johnny, <gasps> uh, what, where, where am I, where is this place, this is my house, what happened, why am I here? Why am I so damaged? Let me... Where's all my stuff? What's happened? What's happened here? Why is all my stuff gone? You know this... <gasps> I remember at the sign! Johnny Gat was here! He must have rigged that place with explosives so then I would die. And then he would be able to bring me here. I didn't even die though. My armor must be really good to be fair. He must have bought me here and then taken all my stuff. Oh, he is clever, isn't he? Right, I need to try and get out of here. So it's night time by the looks of things. So I should be able to, he should be asleep, hopefully. So if I'm able to get out of this cell somehow, I should be able to just make a mad dash for it and hopefully not wake him up. Where's my stuff gone? Am I still be at the scene of the crime? It might be stored here. Okay, okay, I'm gonna have to look around. I'm gonna have to try and get out, and I'm gonna have to try and look around. I can't possibly punch through these walls. I've got nothing to do it with. I can't do it with my hands. What am I going to do? What's... What's this through here? So, it's a one block wide wall, so... If I... <gasps> where I... Where... Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, yes! Oh yes, I am the most clever person to ever live. Don't go back in there. Right, so I must. This must be where I was. Yeah, the Hoovian Wizard Sal. He's been planning this for a while. Then his base is certainly a lot bigger than it was before. Oh yeah, but remember we launched the counter attack on Christmas Day. Oh my goodness, the time machine. The time machine. We need to. We need to destroy this thing. I meant to do it on Christmas, but I forgot it with all the good spirits. Right. I'm gonna have to do that a bit later because I can't afford to do that now. The wizard stuff, that's me. This is, oh yes, this is all my stuff, this is all my stuff. Right, um, let's quickly grab all this. Let's quickly grab all this. We're just gonna have to run. I don't even care about organizing my inventory at this point. I need to grab everything I can and get out of this place. Uh, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Uh, pumpkin, pie, coal, there we go. I need something to eat to get my health up. I'm so damaged right now, okay, okay. Right, how do I get out of this place? Where even is this place? I assume it's the same place it was before. I, did, I need to get my bow out. I need to get ready for this. I've got ten arrows, so I need to make every arrow count. Right, hello sheep. Where... Okay, right. So, I don't think Johnny gets here, but I need to make sure I don't run into him on the way back. Right. I think that might be a good way of getting out, because you'll think I'm going to go through the front room. What's, up? What's all this stuff up here? Uh, storeroom, viewing area, okay, so we've got another viewing area, what's this door down here? The bedroom, the bedroom, the bedroom, can you hear that? I can hear him snoring inside, okay, okay, he's asleep, this is my perfect chance to get away. My perfect chance to get away, right. Excuse me, Mr. Sheep, please don't tell anyone. Um, okay, so there's, there's my house down there. Oh no, the roof's gone! How much damage did that do? How much TNT was down there? I'll give it to him. That must have been quite a lot of TNT to make that sort of damage. Right, okay, I just need to get down here 
as fast as I can and try and get back to safety and back to my house. Right, I don't think he's coming after me. I don't think he even knows I've escaped. Right, okay, I can't see anything. Okay, let's just run back here and make sure that the damage wasn't too serious. Because if it was, that's going to be a little bit bad, really. Because I would rather it not be that bad because I don't want my elder... Oh, no. How did he do this much damage? I didn't even get the terracotta that I needed. Oh, wait, hold on. Yes, I did. <laughs> oh, wow, I did as well. Forget that. Right. Well, I got everything that I needed from here, but it's sort of been slightly destroyed. Okay, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. So, okay. I've just stolen all the terracotta out of here. I'm fine. I've got what I came for, at least. That was quite nice, actually. Right, so now I just... I, I'm just going to get out of this area, to be honest. I need to wait until it's a bit safer. I'm going to wait until it's day, and then I'm going to try and come back and repair this. But I need to stop coming around here. It's, it's just essentially claim this entire half of the map. He just rigged this entire place with explosives by the sound of things. By the look of things, even. That must have been why he needed all the redstone from this. From these things. The head and the dragon heads. Because without that, he couldn't have rigged it so the entire house exploded. It would have just been a one bang in the middle. Which, admittedly, would have still been enough to knock me out. But hey, we can only assume. Well, we can't. We can also make an educated guess. But hey, we, we've got to get out of here. Alright, so let's try and quickly swim over this ocean. Let's try and get back to safety. I need to make sure that the dock's alright as well. Because if you remember at Christmas, the dock was his first target. So is Laurie. So I need to go and make sure that those two are okay. Uh, because they are the two things that I need to make sure they're okay. Otherwise, I can't do anything really. And Mr. Pando, Mr. Pando should be okay. Because he was there in the morning, uh, just gone. So let's go through here and try and find him. Hello, Mr. Sheep. Hello, Mr. Llama. It's a really like, where are all the meanie beanies? <laughs> they just seem to have gone. Maybe they're all just in his castle or something. I don't know. But hey, it seems to be quite a nice night, considering that that's just happened. And there is the moon. I think it's, the moon's just going down as well, actually. Right, so message to note to self even. Don't go around that side of the map, especially alone, because he's probably rigged the entire place with explosives. That's a pretty easy thing to remember, really. Maybe start... Actually, the, the armour was able to protect me from dying, actually, so I'll take that. Pretty good armour overall, really, isn't it? Right, so... Uh, where's the dock? Oh, I've just gone past the dock, haven't I? I wasn't paying attention. I was just came back to my bedroom. Right, so Laurie should be through here. And I can hear, I think that's Smokey barking. So at least I know the dogs are okay. Right, okay, he seems to be okay down there. There's a light on, so I assume he's in. Right, so let's just go around back here. And that was a little bit strange. And let's close this because that was pretty bad, to be honest. I need to make sure that that does not happen again and I'm going to go and check that the dock is okay because I don't know what he's even trying to do like he just seems to be mindlessly blowing things up so I don't know what his plan is or anything it's not very obvious really but maybe that's what he wants me to think maybe he's throwing all these red herrings everywhere so let's just go through there and dock you are okay dock 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 hello oi 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 I get Oi, Doc, I'm talking to you. There we go. Right, you're not going to believe what just happened, Doc. And you're still alive this time, so that's a plus side. Yeah, I know. St can you stop humming when I'm speaking, please? Thank you very much, Doc. But, however, what I have to say is, in fact, I just got kidnapped by Johnny Gap. I just escaped. I need you. Yes, Dr. Peterson, you. And your name tag just disappeared yet again to build defences around this world to make sure it doesn't get blown up that badly again. Okay, good. Right, I need you total surveillance. I need you to be going around the map. I need you to be going to track him down and telling me exactly where he is at all time. Use a drone if you want, but hey, I don't really care. So actually it might be quite useful for you to build a drone. 
you should try doing that and then you can use it for reconnaissance missions and maybe it'll come handy in the future if there's a zombie apocalypse or something I don't really know right so um yeah that was an episode and a half already wasn't it uh right so I think I'm just going to end that video here to be honest I know I'm building a florist and all that but I don't I'm not really in the mood to build a florist after all that I just sort of want to just sort of chill a little bit maybe watch some TV in my living room up there where it was I can't see it there's a house in the way my living room up there with a the TV in it I don't know I'm just sort of going to relax a little bit because honestly I'm going to be scarred for life after that um so yeah i hope you enjoyed the video uh it wasn't trying to fool any of you it's just a little bit of fun uh the next video will be online next week as always and the link will be in the description once it is so i thank you for watching and goodbye